Welcome to Mac Review. I'm your host, Drake. Today we're at D4 Irish Pub and Cafe in Chicago. Surprise, surprise. Reviewing their lobster mac and cheese. It's got some lobster, uh, some English peas, some breadcrumbs, and the, uh, the nicer spirals that I can't pronounce. Something with a C. For those of you joining us for the first time, we'll be looking at this mac today based on three things. Flavor, texture, consistency. Flavor, how's it taste? texture, how's it feel in your mouth, and consistency, are you getting the same bite every bite? Each out of five, total out of 15. Let's get right into it. Ooh, that looks very good. Try and get a little bit of everything in there. Ooh. 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 I'm gonna go with a four for flavor. Lobster, strong, breadcrumbs actually have flavor more than just texture, and the peas give it just a little, little cold kick. Cold sense in your mouth. Cheese is great. Texture, let's try and get everything. I'd go with the four again. Noodles cooked to perfection. Lobster grade. The breadcrumbs. Enough texture. And they're offset by the peas softness. As for consistency, we're going to have to dig a little bit for this one. Yeah, get in there, see what you can see. We've got peas, we've got lobster, not many breadcrumbs, it looks like the breadcrumbs are just our topping. But let's see what we're getting. I'm gonna give it a three. It's good, I mean, pretty much everything's represented throughout the entire thing, with the exception of the breadcrumbs, and you can kind of tell the difference in the taste. So overall, we're looking at a whopping 11 out of 15. Nothing to scoff at. Very good tasting mac. Very well textured. Consistency though, about what you'd expect from a restaurant mac. Tune in next week when we'll be reviewing another type of mac and cheese. Mm -hmm.